Watch canoe beat the daylights out of its electric vans. Worried that the odd-looking canoe won't be safe? Canoe's working to have that covered. It's always attention-grabbing when a brand is willing to show you its vehicles in a vulnerable state, and the crash testing videos the canoe just released are must see. During the lease plan virtual EV summit in November, Gary Gumashian, global vice president of Canoe, repeated the automaker's plans that we've covered before, but he also went into detail about the safety technology involved with making a vehicle like this come to life. It was an interesting portion of the summit and shed some light on what it takes to be an automaker now that EVs are starting to become mainstream. We can't forget what it takes to bring a vehicle to market, said Gumushian during a Zoom call in which his video background made it look like he was sitting in the back of one of the lifestyle, gamma, vehicles we recently drove. To really drive home his point, he showed off the many crash tests Canoe has put its lifestyle vehicle through. Keep in mind, such development isn't merely difficult for a startup. Major OEMs put in just as much work testing their safety systems. It's tough given the LV's nearly forward control design and semi-drive-by-wire systems. Nor were these your typical crash tests you'd see from the National Highway and Traffic Safety Administration NHTSA, either. As Gumashian stated, these vehicles are aimed at 5-star ratings. That explains why the video shows lifestyle prototypes launching off ramps and landing hard on their battery cases. Riding themselves after being launched off a rollover sled and into a dirt pit. Driven off a steep embankment. Driven at speed over an 8-inch curb. And even sent off a half ramp to test rollover resistance. Not only did the canoe remain upright, but its battery pack never showed any catastrophic damage. We've crashed these vehicles hundreds of times, we've put them through millions of miles, Gumushian further elaborated, every one of these crashes, the battery was not damaged. He credited the lack of pack damage to how Canoe packages its battery pack inside the lifestyle vehicle's frame, ensuring the pack survives no matter what types of impacts it sees. These tests are a remarkable testament to what our vehicle is able to do, he said while also marveling at just how crash-survivable Canoe's vehicles are. We'll need to wait and see how the cars handle IIHS and NHTSA crash tests to see if all this work pays off.